Hey, you hungry? You hungry, right? What you want? You want this? You want this? Hmm? You want this, right? You want this, right? Okay, you wait. You wait. I'm gonna give it to you. You wait, okay? So let me see. We're gonna put this in here. Put the chicken in here. She likes chicken. She likes the sasami. I always mix the sasami and the... It's hard to do with one hand. But then you mix the sasami. I should've got my gimbal. I could've did this with both hands. But uh, yeah, she likes the sasami mix. Do that in there, right? And then I usually take this little, one of her treats, and I break it up real kind of small. Just break it up small. And I put it in there like, like that, and then she's, yeah, she, she knows it's coming. Yeah, you know, she knows she's into it. And uh, <clears throat> she used to get kind of picky. And so we just spoiling her now. You know, I've been spoiling her like this for a while now, so it's kind of like a, a habit now. I usually take that, and then I, I take this. This, uh, this is a special gourmet can food, which is kind of special. It's like not the normal cheap can stuff that you normally get. This is stuff here is like. You could probably eat it, man. I mean, it just smells like uh, corned beef, it's something that we would get in a can that we would eat ourselves, you know? That's what it smells like. I wouldn't, I mean, if I was starving, I wouldn't starve, I would I would eat this. I'd probably fry this up, put it in there and fry that up, man. So I usually put that in there and then I, you know, dogs, man, they, they, they like olive oil. Olive oil is, is it's good. Put a little olive oil, touch of olive oil, extra virgin olive oil. And then on top of that, you know, in the wild, they would eat raiding hen houses, you know, foxes and stuff. Give her that raw diet feel, you know, so I, I give her an egg in there, you know, and I, I wash my hands first. She doesn't mind if I do this this way. Sometimes I throw a little salt in there, you know, just, just to help her get her daily intake of salt, you know, just a little bit. I give her some of that salt in there. Just a little bit, not much, you know. I'm just just a little bit, you know. Let me see here. You know, not much, just, just a touch, you know. That's why they lick you sometimes, they like that salt. This is not coming out. Okay, that, that's, that's, that was enough. That was probably about enough. But uh, yeah, you mix it all around, this is per volume, it's not much. But she likes that. And when she was picky, if I did this, she would always eat it right up. And even now though, she's gonna look at it for a second and, and think twice and decide whether or not she's gonna jump on it or not. But uh, she should, she should just eat it up, right? This way, she's really pushing her weight back on, and she's uh, enjoying her, her meals every time. And uh, you know, you might some people might say it's going too far for your your doggy, but she's part of the family, and uh, that's what I do for her. And that's the way she eats. This is how we roll here. Yeah, chow down, baby.